else, I'll just be sad no matter what. Yeah, happens. yeah. But uh, yeah, uh, I'm really excited for this match because Falcon. Once you get in on Richter, Richter doesn't breathe for like a, a not... solid minute. Like you carry him from left to right, he's off stage almost guaranteed, and and then you can try to get your edge guard. But if if Dom sets up, uh, which is playing very much a setup character, and yes. he's able to set up against Falcon, it's so hard for Falcon to get in and actually do anything. The trick here is to smother Richter with your great speed, yeah. your aerials, and also your movement yeah. over him. Richter is one of those characters that even in his own game of Castlevania, if a character can come close to you too fast, he will lose. It's, it, that's what's kind of funny about the Belmonts. They're so true to their own game, man. Have you ever played a Castlevania and you try to hit the little frogman and they just jump over you because they're too small and too fast? Yeah, I know what that feels like. That's essentially what will happen to the character. And Fatality with a character like Falcon who has the speed, the combos, the burst damage, it's going to be an interesting matchup to see. Dude, Fatality has a freaking bracket today, man. He had to uh, fight the Falco agenda, you know? He had to fight E3 Dom. <laughs> when I picked him up from the airport, I asked him, how was your flight? He said to me only one thing. I spent the last five hours studying every player I might possibly play. <laughs> wow. Okay. So that's, you know, that's helpful. I'm assuming he's watching a lot of Dom bots then because this is probably the scariest part of his bracket. Let's be real. Like, if, if, if he's fighting Dom, I think he must have either beat Baladin or the person who beat Val or the person who might have beat Baladin as well. Because I know Baladin was definitely in Fatality's bracket. Right. And I think so is Chad. I'm not too sure. Okay. Well, either way, man, Dom making waves. So, yeah, this is going to be really exciting to watch. Uh, Falcon also just, like, cannot get off the ledge versus Richter. It's even harder than it is for Shulk because he doesn't have a jump monado or, mm -hmm. or a jump art, sorry, or a speed art in order to get off. It's like one controls the ground and the other controls the overall ledge. Yeah, yeah. You have to see it. It's kind of like one controls the inner circle and one the other controls the outer circle of the stages, and you have to be very, very careful. Very true. All right, Town and City for our fourth game in a row. <laughs> Dom picks the stage a lot, though. I don't know. I don't know. It's it's the mindset of I have space to move around yes. and those platforms to land on right. when I get juggled. That makes sense. Yeah, man. Oh, my gosh. I, okay, this is my prediction for at least game one. I think Fatality is going to get absolutely rocked on this first stock because he's not going to know what's going on. He's never played against Dom before, as far as mm -hmm. I you know, am aware. He is going to get rolled on this first stock, and then it's going to be a lot more even after he starts kind of figuring out what he needs to do. That's just my humble commentary prediction that could be completely incorrect. He could just hit a knee right here and just end it. You know, I never know. That was a weird whiff from Dom. Uh, he had all the time in the world there after that upbeat. And despite Dom having a lot of stage control most of the time, as we see, Rolled. Fatality is not too far behind. <laughs> I'm kidding, I'm kidding. Okay, 112. Fatality has to go for that lower recovery. I like that, and he jumps as yeah, soon as he is, sees that. That is your beautiful way to God. get off the ledge. You have, you have like a small window as Falcon <laughs> to jump up and down air if you catch Dom throwing out the wrong projectile. And uh, and yeah, Fatality executed it beautifully. I was completely wrong. You know, he's not getting rolled. I'm sorry. <laughs> I don't know what I'm talking about. All right. The, co the common. It's the been com a while. I like that. Save that jump, and he wants to see if T3 will go for some kind of spot dodge. Oh my God! Three F tilts in a row, just whipping him. That saved his life. That projectile was the only thing keeping him from that uh, Falcon there. All right. Dom looking to set up here kindly yeah, and needs nicely. something here because if he yeah if he doesn't take the stock now, Fatality has full rage. Uh, you know you, you don't really have a confirm at this percent. You have to hit a straight hit like that. So, yeah. Yeah. But Fatality very 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 close to uh, taking the second stock. A B out of shield doesn't quite work on the down tilt. But up B just when you're pressuring his shield will work just fine. Wow. That was really weird. Good for good for Vitality to understand how T3 might be playing from the ledge. Yeah. Let's go of that, but he knows what he gains from it too. He knows T3 will go for some kind of projectile in which he can punish him for it. They're playing hot potato. Okay, it's over. <laughs> Whoa, they both did it. They both kicked. That looked cool. He might be dead. He got okay, so Vitality messed up the timing of his down air. Kind of predicted that Dom would come up a little faster than he did, and Dom gets a second chance at life, but it is looking rough for uh, for Dom on this game one. Oh. 
Vitality, basically one good exchange away from uh, from taking this first first game. <laughs> okay, I have to come in that, that jab jab yeah, option. Yeah, that was sick. He, he jab jab yeah. and then turned around and upbeat in the opposite direction. And he knew what to do right there. Yeah. That was well played. Even though we didn't see. Oh, okay. yeah, can't be doing that. Can't not be doing that. It the really shoe? feels like both of them struggle uh, at the ledge a lot. Yeah, each other. the shoe is on the other foot because usually T3 has people hanging on the ledge, but this time Fatality's got him yeah. hanging. All right, man. So let's see what Dom is going to do in order to uh, change this up. I would actually like to see Dom opt for a smaller stage. It might be to his benefit to go for something like Smash Smashville in particular. Yeah. Um, Only because then Falcon doesn't have the exactly. leisure of literally just running the opposite direction and standing on a platform way up here. Exactly. And, 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 like and now and we do, we do see Smashville. Yeah. And Dom doesn't want Battlefield either because Falcon gets still so much from yeah, those triplats. Yeah. You so. get so many combo tools out of platforms like that. So I really like this pick. I don't know how comfortable uh, Fatality is on Smashville, but I like this idea a lot. Normally, when you play a projectile character, the first thing you think of is, I don't like small stages. But in uh, in Richter's case, you have so much range with your whip that you almost have a sword along with like all the projectiles you have. So a stage yeah. like Smashville can really work to your benefit, where you can, again, like we saw in his other games, you can turtle under the one platform and control left and right just with your projectiles. And it will be very, very hard for, uh, for Fatality to get in. But you know, if you never get there uh, and you just die, oh. A little touch, of the, little touch of the knee there, but that's not yeah. enough. A B, no, I like that from Dom. Goes for Nair, and he sets him up at the center Ooh. stage. We're going to try to juggle Ooh. Fatality. Catches the Falcon kick and catches him landing with the down smash. That was so good from Yeah, Dom. and I like that coverage. Down smash has such a wide arc. Yeah, and he still didn't die. <laughs> <laughs> it goes to show, man. Fatality knows his DI. That was actually a really good DI from Fatality. If he di DI'd any other way, I think he was dead. Nice. Save that jump. Doesn't give T3 the yeah. time to go for a confirm afterwards. Dom being a little more careful at the ledge to when he throws out his projectiles, but unfortunately going to die to the dash attack there. If he can clean this up right here, this would be really good for Dom. Oh, what a it. play. But oh, not enough. Not the like. D I'm telling you, he knows his DI. That was also a really good DI. There one. Oh. Nice. Into a quick down throw. And look at this control. What a corner carry yeah. right from the other side of the stage. 37%, not too bad for Dom just yet. He really doesn't want to get grabbed right now, though. Good for the back throw. You still want him off the stage. Yeah. Like, getting grabbed uh, is probably the worst thing that can happen to you right now as Dom. So just keeping that option away. Yeah, yeah. Beautiful stuff from Dom. Spacing out the uh, the nares with his own back airs. Uh-oh. That's a big up air. Ooh, nice come down with the nares. Yeah, yeah. And that was good, too, because I mean, we saw Fatality go for a, possibly an empty hop in that yeah. situation. Could have led to so much great in there. He's got Dom off the stage, looking to see if he can put anything out there, but Dom will never give up when he's from the depths. Yeah. That's a beautiful recovery from Dom as well. Again, you gotta be careful with those with those projectiles. Fatality mm. will jump over your head and down air you so fast. He's caught up to that game plan. Yeah. Alright, couple up airs before even the down air can start. I like that from Fatality, looking to use these back airs at the ledge. Alright, Dom's big chance here to uh, kind of steal the lead away from Fatality. Kind of a risky Falcon kick from Fatality. Cool. He's fighting for center a little bit. Dom seemingly has a little bit more control right now. Oh, the next hit is so important. Oh. Okay. Okay, not yet, 171. I'm surprised you could live that at 171 still. Oh! Wow, again, trying to get the jab, jab, up B, but not connecting. And the, and the reason why is usually you're, you would panic. That's yeah, your option. You yeah. want to get out. So Fatality is trying to read that within T3 Dom's bare soul at this point. Dom has finally been able to really set up his character the way that he wants to. Yeah, Dom, he, he may not be. Okay, finally, a little bit of a break for yeah, Dom. Yeah, caught him dashing underneath his feet. And uh, Dom, with his first lead here, big chance to take this to game three. That's a lot of damage. Well, okay, it's 18%. I should get ahead of myself. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you know what, though? I feel it. I feel it. The crowd has gathered around just to just yeah. watch what's going it on. It felt like a lot, but, yeah. you know. 18%. I'll tell you what, he is working a lot. Oh well, my god, sure. but he just need him and now he's in the lead. Oh. <laughs> okay, holy water there. Dom How is set Fatality going to get off the ledge? He's got to watch. He's been so good at timing himself. 
This time he's able to get back on. Now yeah. I'm not so surprised. That was a really nice uh, second Vitaly. hit. Man. That's it. That's it's it. Over. That's it. Yeah, over. that's it. Fatality what a Fatality takes air. it 2 0 -oh over Dom. Uh, well fought by Dom for sure, but yeah. uh, Fatality finally capitalizing on getting a